Hello, and finally I'm making a new video. Sorry for the lack of uploads recently, I have just haven't got round to making any new videos. But I've got lots of new items to make videos about, so this is the first one I'm going to be making. Um, it is the Chinese MF11B. Um, it's, it's unissued. But I don't think this is the original box, mainly because it's not in Chinese. Um, but it has the size on top, medium, but I'm not sure how that's that. I'm not sure how that... I'm not sure how... <laughs> Sorry. I'm not sure if that's how they actually rate sizes in China with their gas masks. I think it's numbers. <sighs> right, um, so it came in a nice plastic bag. Yeah, it was literally just the mask and filter and stuff. It didn't come with a bag or anything. So yeah, this is the mask itself. So I just need to check to see if that's in focus. Yeah, that's the mask. Um, it's made of black rubber. And inside you've got the filter, still sealed, and a kind of face form thing. Um, it's got nice triangular eye lenses. And this thing on the side is a filter breathing resistance simulator. Um, it's just a kind of thin mesh thing, kind of like paper, I guess, um, which matches the resistance of the filter, which I shall show you now. So it's just standard 40 millimeter. Um, don't know what else to say about that. Right uh, right, and give you some details about the mask. I'll show you the exhale assembly first. This is it. They've been using this design for absolutely ages. Um, it's very unique. It's, as you can see, all the way around the edge. It has the holes for the exhalation of air. As you can see there. And that is a blue rubber, which is, I'm not sure how clear it is because I haven't really tested it yet. And it just comes out like that. You can see all the stuff. I'll just leave that out for now because I can't be bothered to put it back in. The um, head harness is made of, um, like, fabric, <laughs> elasticated fabric. Um... The mask itself is very comfortable. It's just, um, yeah, because of the head harness, what it's made out of. And I don't know, it's just really comfortable to wear. Um, give you an inside view of the mask. Right, this is the inside of the mask. It's not brilliant. Literally, the, the oral nasal cup isn't really an oral nasal cup. It doesn't really make a proper seal, but the eye lenses don't fog up, so it's okay. Um, this mask doesn't actually have a lot of markings on it. The... Uh, where is it? There's just a marking down here. Not sure what it means. And... There's another sticker here. I think it... Not sure what it is, maybe the date it was made, but I think it's in Chinese. Or something. Well, it's probably not in Chinese because it's just numbers, but it could, I'm not sure which way it goes up, it could be that way, it could be that way, who knows, But and I have no idea what it means. So now I'll just show you what, it look, what the mask looks like on a person. So yeah, this is the mask on me. Apologies if you can't hear me very well, I haven't actually tested the voice diaphragm yet to see how clear it is. So, front of the mask, side mask, oh, side mask, bottom, top. Yeah, um, as I said earlier, it's surprisingly comfortable. The oral nasal cup is really bad, it doesn't make a seal at all. But the eye lenses don't fog up much, so that's good. Um, that's all I really have to comment on at the moment. 
so yeah. Also this came with a mask, it's a translated version of the instruction manual that would be issued with the mask if you were in the Chinese army. Sorry. Um, so there's just a diagram of it. I'll zoom in if you're interested. And it's got some statistics and specifications here. And the rest is just what you'd expect in an instruction booklet. It's got a nice little diagram there as well of how to fit the mask correctly, like how to size it. Um, that's pretty much it for that leaflet. Not a lot else to it, it's literally what you'd expect. Chinese MF11 or the FMJ05 is China's current issue mask. Um, it's used by the People's Liberation Army, civilians um, in areas like um, just various industries, scientific research, like where you'd need a mask of some sort, um, agriculture, that kind of business. There are other variants of this mask. Um, There'd be a drinking tube just about here, I think, for one variant. And there are variants with different eye lenses, kind of circular shaped instead of the triangle shape, kind of, uh, similar to the FM12, uh, those kind of masks. The military variant of this mask comes with a box and stuff, like a bag. So I guess this is the civilian version. I didn't actually um, think about that before, but yeah, I guess this is the civilian version. But if that was the case, I don't know why it came with the breathing resistance simulator because surely that would be used for training. Who knows? So yeah, that's pretty much it for this mask, guys. Um, expect loads more videos to come soon, hopefully, because I'm on half term at the moment, meaning lots of free time. Um, and I've got lots of new items to review or give you information about, such as the... Czech M52U and the German M65. Um, got a couple of other things that he's do as well. So I'll do that uh, once again. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you f hope I hope you found this review informative um, and interesting. Uh, so yeah, see you in the next video.